what you've been waiting for. Your ultimate champions, Trinity Centurion! is the coach of the Minecraft Twitch Security team and they just won. My oh, man, congratulations. Thank, thank you, thank, thank you, thank you. Look at that smile, man. <laughs> and cold is no, smile. No, no, no. no, no. You don't know. Yeah. It's absolutely phenomenal. For our team who has started by uh, losing, the first time that we, go, uh, we played and we uh, lost, and the kids were so disappointed. Uh, and just coming here and having come out second place on the previous one in Comic Con uh, playing as a team and even at the end they said the one team member wasn't uh, part wasn't with them so they, they went back and because they went back they weren't able to Is that a nice way of saying you, you cut out the, the weakest thing? <laughs> we can say something like that we oh, can say something yeah, like okay. that so how many hours do you, do you guys put in? I, I must say I can't so normally we the EdTech lab, that's my class. Uh -huh. So they'll stay in that lab um, every single day when they have free time. Uh -huh. And that also helps out because now they don't get to um, go out there loitering around, not, doing, uh -huh. not knowing what to do their time. Discipline. So, exactly. So having that discipline within them, I've seen a couple of them whom we see in classrooms um, not really being recognized for anything. Uh -huh. But then out of them playing Esports, you see our captain just blossoming out, and you see his leadership potential, and something that we never saw. Yeah. So, where do you see the future of esports in, in school and stuff like that? So, where's from where we began? Um, RGB was one of the major tournaments that we wanted to take part. In. Shout out! Shout out to RGB! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, um, and we started out. Um, unfortunately, we weren't in the games, and luckily, they gave us an opportunity without even being paid, without without us mm. being part yeah. of the leads and everything. Oh, that's RGB for you. They yeah. always yeah. They, yeah. they called us. Uh, Listen, man, can you come through? And our kids were just happy to be here, and they were happy to be here with the split team uh, tournament. And yeah. we, from just that, we were able to grow our esports um, from just having. Grade seven, uh, grade seven group, um, and they're feeding it up with a grade four. So now we actually have grade fours who are aesthetic about these sports, and you'll see them. The parents are also um, joining. So we have a developmental team that we will feed in into the grade, grade sevens, and now with the plan is to also feed it up to the grade highs. One one of the game titles that we're really aesthetic about is Fortnite. Um, as well as uh, Rocket League. Okay, so yeah. that's the ones that we you know, yeah, and, and the 13 games. Actually, PG 13, 13 games. Yes. But yeah. we really want to give an awesome shout out to our principals. Um, they really have been um, supporting us from the get go. They have been there from the uh, moment that we started. Uh, and you can imagine, it is Christian school. So there's a lot of people who don't really believe in uh, gaming uh, because of the kind of. Um, violence and perception, and yeah. perception yeah. that comes in. Yeah. And our principal, he literally um, supported us from the get go. He told us, no, let's do this, but let's try and make it, let's try and make gaming in a place that is controlled. Yeah, shout man, out to, yeah. to Mr. Benzo, shout out to Mr. David, shout, shout out, out to uh, Mr. Simon, and shout out most of all to RGB. Yeah. 